Well, joining me now from Cairo, Cairo is reporter Edouard Cousin. Edouard, first of all, what more do we know about Abdel Fattah's condition? Well, well, very, very little. Um, we know that he stopped drinking water in addition to his hunger strike on Sunday. Uh, and we know now that uh, authorities say they staged a medical intervention. But what is medical intervention is? Is it force feeding? Is it putting on IV? Uh, they don't know. Um, and that, that's also the main worry his family has now. Eh? His, his uh, mother, Leila Swave, and his sisters um, are, um, her sister said, told media that, that like they're in a state of panic now. They, they don't know what's happening to him. They don't know what his condition is. They don't even know if he's actually alive or if that's something um, prison authorities are just saying. Because for the past days, they haven't got any signal, any communication with him in prison. No letters were allowed in or out. Uh, no visits were allowed by his mom, who had tried repeatedly over the past days. Um, so yeah, they 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 um, they are very worried, and I hope they are allowed to 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 see him soon. Worth emphasizing, though, Edouard, that international pressure on Egypt in this case is mounting, particularly right now, because the country is currently hosting the COP twenty seven climate summit. Is that likely to have any impact on uh, his case and his imprisonment? Well, it, it's it's very very hard to tell. Uh, that's obviously what his family hopes for. Right? Like actively campaigning around the COP27 in in Egypt to raise his case, and uh, politicians are meeting with President Sisi of Egypt and raising also his case and pressuring for his release, like Emmanuel Macron, um, Rishi Sunak, and and Joe Biden from the US will re arrive in Egypt tomorrow. Is also said to be raising his case. Um, one thing is 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 clear though that Egypt really hoped with this hosting this COP, uh, that it would raise its image and that it would focus uh, the international attention on Egypt on this, this climate conference. But instead, all, yeah, the majority of global attention is now going to human rights violations in Egypt, is going to this case of Allah Abdel Fattah. And um, you see that official, Egyptian officials are uh, upset by that. Huh? They, 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 they made remarks in the Egyptian media um, that this case of Abdel Fattah is just an an attempt to deflect attention from the COP. Um, so, so they're clearly not happy about it, but uh, with all eyes in the world now focused on Egypt and on this COP, there, there's little they can do um, to yeah, to change this uh, this spotlight away from uh, Abdus' case, except releasing him. Edouard Kouza in Cairo, thanks very much indeed for your reporting.